Welcome to Toad Vlogs. This is the morning show, and I would like to, uh, this is a uh, follow-up to my Wisconsin story from yesterday. I've had uh, two of my uh, viewers, uh, Stephen and uh, Joseph, were commenting on the fact that they believe that public unions have to be removed. Private unions, they believe, are okay, but public unions have to be removed. And Joseph went into more details about how he believes that because they are paid for by taxes, that they do not have any rights to organize. And uh, I thought that was a pretty interesting uh, viewpoint. Um, do public unions have a right to organize? Do they have a right to negotiate their wages? Um, for the simple reason that they we do pay them with our taxes. Uh, my point would be that we don't get, you know, when a private company applies for a public a contract, they negotiate uh, what they're going to get paid. They, they put a bid in. And I don't see how that is much different from, you know, workers organizing to decide what they get paid. Yes, they're paid by taxes, but they are still workers, and workers should be paid and should have the right to have some say in what they get paid. Now, companies would like to say that, you know, no worker should have any rights to say what they get paid. They should be paid, you know, the lowest amount that they will accept. And, of course, that's in their best interest, and I understand that. And, you know, governments... Um, do have a certain amount of degree of, you know, to the timing. You know, they yeah, they don't want to look bad of picking on unions, and unions use that. I understand that. But they are still workers, and they have the right to negotiate, in my opinion. I don't have to be right. That's just my opinion. So, um, I believe that the policemen and the firemen, teachers... They have pretty hard jobs, and they deserve to get paid. And you know what? If they get paid better, they spend that money on private businesses. And private businesses employ private people. So the money comes back. Now, rich people, when they get money, they can only spend so much of it here. And the rest of it, they hide. They put in banks. They put in Swiss bank accounts. They, you know, they buy yachts and stuff that they don't necessarily buy from here. So... Yeah, I'd rather have the money circulating through the people and pay, you know, when people are paid a little bit more, it pushes up everybody. It doesn't put other people down. But when you bring those private uh, pri uh, public unions down, the private unions are going to have to go down too because they're not going to be compatible. So, uh, yeah, I have to disagree with you guys, but thank you for your comments. Bye-bye.